what's the problem going to be tomorrow so that when tomorrow comes, you're one of the few experts. So that's my advice to especially people starting their career or at the beginning of their career. Don't think that you're going to retire here now because with technology evolution going so quickly, it's just not going to happen. Sounds like uh, a quote I can't remember of Einstein, but I will look it up uh, afterwards. But what do you think, think with this uh, constant change, the role of universities and traditional school systems uh, will be? Because now you can follow a bachelor degree for four years in economics, and then you can also do a master's degree in finance for to become an accountant or an investment ban banker. But probably with the rapid pace that we are advancing now and the technology around us, these jobs are most likely maybe not existing or have transferred into other sorts of jobs. So what do you think about that? Yeah, so, well, if you think about it, in 2012, I wanted to learn about uh, AI. So I did uh, a machine learning cor course on Coursera. My wife is currently finishing her, her deep learning courses on Coursera. And I think the future is not let's go to stuffy old building and have a professor in front of 300 people going over their book. It's about, let's help you learn new things on your pace, your speed with the exact help that you need for the problem that you want to become an expert in and earn money with tomorrow. So, so are you saying that students of today should go to Coursera or Udemy instead of following a three-year uh, course? Is that what you're saying? Or Well, it's good to go to university to get to the basics, but um, I'm not convinced that in 20 years' time people will follow that same path. 